increment and decrement operators are very important, especially in loops or a kind of repetitive blocks of code. And we have two kinds of uh, operators, increment, increase in value of variable by one, and decrement, decrease in value of variable by one, exactly by one. And there is difference if you want to use the operators. The difference is uh, in placement. We can place increment or decrement operators after variable or before variable. And what what is the difference? The difference is because if we place, uh, let's say in this case, increment operator after variable, it means that first our variable is returned and after that its value is increased by one. For this reason, we use increment operator so value of our variable x should increase by one however it's still eight because we placed increment operator after our variable which means that first this variable is returned for this reason we can see it unchanged still eight and after that this value is increased by one for this reason in second line we have exactly what we expect, 9. The same is with decrement operator, 2 minuses. Uh, we place it after x, which means that first x value will be returned not changed, we have still 8, and after that, in next line, this value is decremented by one and we have seven. Uh, we could place this minus before and now we can see that value of our variable is first decremented by one and then returned. For this reason we have straight away seven and the second line is the same because we repeat value of our variable. If we place increment operator before our variable, it means it will be incremented before it's returned. So for this reason, we have straight away 9. It's incremented first by 1. So we have 9 and then it's returned. In next line is the same value, which is 9. The difference between in placement of increment or decrement operator is very important uh, in loops especially and sometimes can be reason of some uh, mistakes. So it's good to know that if we place increment operator or decrement operator before variable, it's not the same like we place it after variable.